see the nice and empty street before um, the nightlife starts and everything will be fine during this time so it's, I think it's the right time to go shopping and here is this uh, nice space uh, in Cesenatico it's uh, behind me you see the Grand Hotel which exists I think around about more than 40 50 years and also you can see the sky wheel behind me so it's a very nice area here to relax and enjoy the day also a little bit of the sun is here and a nice um, surrounding with shops and also a nice uh, gelatari and so you can see, I want to go now to the sky wheel behind me just to see in the near, you have seen it from the beach to, from the water to the beach. And now I want to check out how it looks like when I'm standing in front of it. So come on. Oh, let's go this way. Okay, now I'm standing in front of the sky wheel and also I have three attractions of Cesenatico with me here uh, and also a uh, helicopter behind me. I don't know why but mm, so behind me you see the sky wheel. I will check la out later how much it is to get a ride with the sky wheel and then on the right side you see the Grand Hotel which I told you before and yes perfect and this is a Grand Resort which or the Grand Hotel which exists for a longer time and this is one of the oldest building here and on the other side you can see one of the uh, not one the highest building of Cesenatico it's uh, also very old and a nice one and also if you go to a description of Cesenatico you will find it and see how big it is and how old it is so it's uh, one of the most attractions here in Cesenatico and when you see in the right side when I, which I see you can see a long street which goes to the center and also to a small channel uh, where I want to go later but first of all I want to go to the sky wheel And here is another nice spot of Cesenatico. Behind me you can see a water place and everything is very calm here in the city and very nice and a lot of friendly people are here and it's just a nice day to relax and have fun in the sun and it's just a great city or a smaller city which small nice buildings older buildings newer ones but I think that also the community looks at all 
fits together, that they have not too many uh, sky highs and a lot of other things. And so you can also see a lot of renovation here during when you go through the streets and see that they rebuild the older um, houses and that they try to do it uh, very beautiful and very nice. So yeah, let's go a little bit more to the harbor. So behind me you can see a small street market. This is where I want to go now and check out what they have there. And just also uh, this nice little bridge over the channel. It's an... Uh, I don't know, I lose the word at the moment. It's an opening bridge so that I can let the boats through. And a little bit windy here, but you can enjoy the view here and it's a nice place. Also, when you look a little bit more left, then you see La Trattoria directly with a view to the channel and yes. So Cesenatico has a lot of small, nice, cute places. So I was a little bit early for the small market. I will come back later when they all have uh, opened. And behind me now you can see a small ferry, which is just uh, here for crossing the channel, just for bicycles and people. And uh, just it's easier than to find a bridge to cross the channel here. And this is for what is a small ferry. You can also see a lot of fisher boats here. And uh, you see all that they all go out in the morning, in the early morning, with all the fishing stuff, because it's not so far away from here through the channel to the sea. And now let's check out more this way. And here is another part. You can see new buildings, old buildings, and also you hear a lot of birds in the background. They are very, very loud, and they look for food. And yes, it's uh, very nice here. So you can also see the old boats and the newer boats, and also some restaurants and some privacy places to sit around and Yes, it's a very nice city here, and when we go this way more, you see the harbor with uh, older ships, with also, uh, which, uh, they do once a year, a procession with uh, ships here from the channel to the mar and back, so it's a very nice, shut up, it's my time, sorry, but the birds are always, uh, laughing about here. So let's go away. And here behind me you can see a lot of the small sailing ships I was talking before. This is uh, for the processions I do every year and they look very nice with the old sails and they are not so big, they are such a smaller uh, boats, but they look very nice. And this is the harbor here because you see the small bridge, the wooden bridge behind me. Here the channel ends, so here is the end of the channel for this part. And you also can see a lot of people around here, they are just have... Uh, some uh, 
shops here and restaurants and they just live here. And everywhere here on the channel you see the fishing boats like on the side here. I don't know for what it is, if it is for fish or maybe for crabs or, but I think maybe for crabs so, or shrimps. I don't know. Maybe one of you can tell me for what kind of ship this is. Look here, you can see a mermaid, also a nice one. And also you can see here some solar panel so that you have also some energy on your boat. Very interesting. This is a funny shop here. It is with dolphins and turtles just for, yes, to see it around. And when you see a little bit more in the shop, you can see that there's a sweets shop where you can every buy every kind of sweets. And so I have to go this way. Oh, cool. shark or Captain Ahab and a cannon. You have to go here and check it out. Cool stuff. Okay, let's go. So behind me you can see some boats, but I don't know how they come in there or how they go out, because here is a closed bridge. I don't know how they can come in. And on the other side is also a closed bridge. So maybe they can fly, I don't know how they come in, or they are just here for decoration, I don't know, uh, but I don't think so. So. Maybe I can ask in the hotel uh, how they come in or how they go out here of it. Uh, you hear, it's a very nice church also around here. And my hotel is on the Via Garibaldi. And you can see here Mr. Garibaldi as a monument. So maybe I can go a little bit like here and then we can see the boats a little bit nearer, but Mr. Garabaldi also needs your attention. They are very nice painted boats with an angel and they look very good. So behind me you can see the end of the small channel which we crossed uh, with a bridge before we saw the small market, the street market. And it's very nice with the 
fontaines and so a lot of uh, fishing people are here to have their food or something like that and just uh, have a nice day. So and behind you, you can see a small uh, entertainment area for kids. So for everybody is uh, used here for the child and also for the bigger people so that they can have a fishing here. And now I'm on my way back to the hotel and I think I have now walked around about maybe two kilometers and now I have to go back and change my shoes and then let's go. So back in the hotel. Now I have to change my shoes, make me a little bit fresh, and then it's dinner time. And yes, it was a nice walk around Cesenatico. I've seen a lot, and maybe after lunch I want to go back to the street market to check out what I can find there. But now I just want to go upstairs to my room.